the young divas who are not only great performers in their own right, as we knew when we saw them on Australian Idol, but together they have so found their niche. We've got Emily, Kate, Paulini, Ricky Lee all in the studio. Ladies, welcome to 2GB once again. Thank you. Hi. Thank you for having Thanks us. Thanks for having Thanks. us here. Now, this may be interesting because we've got more microphones than almost people in the studio at the moment, <laughs> so this could be interesting. Can I take you back to the AFL Grand Final? 95,000 yes. oh. people. That Seriously, was amazing. the atmosphere in that place was yep. just electric, like yep. amazing. You Had look you up and before? you just go... No. Yeah, we have actually. I have. Been there. Oh, okay. Have you guys... Yeah, that yeah, was our second year. That was, that was our second, second time. Yeah. Is that right? Well, yeah. You will never probably play in front of an audience like that unless you go to Wembley and play in front of oh, 10,000. Okay, yeah. Whoever's um, organising that, can we play? Yeah, yeah. yeah. We'll, yeah. We'll, yeah. we'll come. Soon. We'll be there. <laughs> we'll, like, we'll go have a concert at Wembley and see how many people we can. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Poor lady, we've got to get the goss out of the way. I noticed reading in the paper today you were spotted with your old boyfriend at Marrickville Metro Food Court yesterday. That's a lie. I can actually <laughs> clarify that. I can say that she was actually with me all day. So. <laughs> and, and as you oh, said before, oh, she rubbish. doesn't go to food courts. She only goes to restaurants. Oh, that's a lie. No, no. A... <laughs> we've got to get the goss out of the way. Okay, so you were elsewhere, um, but you're still friends with Wiz, right? Yeah, okay. still good friends. It's only yeah. friends and all. Okay, we get that out of the way. All right. <laughs> You all have such incredible talent. What I didn't know, and I was told today, is that you're also pursuing your own individual careers, although you're do devoting your time in, in the Young Divas as well. Yeah. Well, individually, let's start with Kate. What are you doing individually? Um, individually right now, it, it's hard to get anything individually done. I mean, the Divas is taking up a lot of time, but I think, you know, I, I, in, in my spare time I'm writing and, and hopefully getting ready to release my own second album, hopefully later next year. Right. Emily? Um, I'm getting my stuff ready. I'm just... Whenever I get time or I get time off, I've just been running in and out of the studio, getting some stuff done with some people. And it should be out soon, but my time is more devoted to the Divas right now. It's all now about the Divas. Yeah. Poor lady, all, all about the Divas for you? Yeah, for me, it's all about the Divas right now. I am writing, actually, but um, priority, Divas. Kate? Definitely. Ricky. Ricky, sorry. Ricky. <laughs> so I've just been to Kate. Yeah, no, um, I've, you know, in the, in the time that we've had to kind of have some time on our own. I've been going, you know, down laying down demos and working with producers and writers and stuff and just, just, you know, starting to get the foundations down for a new thing. But, you know, as, as we say, you know, Divas is taking up so much time and Divas we're priority. all really devoted to, you know, pushing it and getting it, getting uh, it as far. Yeah. A lot of our listeners saw the ABBA special on Channel 9, Ricky and, of course, Pauline. How did you enjoy that, doing ABBA? Oh, it was, that was great. awesome. We, we were actually um, sitting in rehearsal, the four of us, and we were thinking... Does that song really? Did ABBA really sing that song? So we didn't really know all of the ABBA songs and yeah. didn't think how popular they were. So the best thing about ABBA is it always just makes you smile. Yeah, ABBA. quite right. And you don't need to have been uh, born or interested in music when they were hot because it's yeah. just it's absolutely. Just absolutely. Well, the music, it's music that lives good on. music lives on, and yeah. it always will. It so, really yeah. is evergreen. Okay, your latest single is a cover of the Lonnie Gordon dance track called "Happening All Over Again." How yeah. did this come about? <laughs> How did it come about? Well, I suppose off the first single, um, This Time I Know It's For Real, that was just such a thing that took a long of life of its own. It happened um, so quickly that we went, well, we need a second single. Um, <laughs> because everybody we wanted one. That was never a plan. There's never meant to be another single or an album. We just went, all right, okay, time to do something. So that sort of just... Popped up. Happened. Popped yeah. up. So, Young Divas, when when can we see the Young Divas uh, out there in concert doing their thing with all of the tracks being played? Oh, hopefully early next year. Right. Yeah. You're going to get on the road? Well, yeah, we've just we come would up love to. to. We've we just come to. off the back of our first tour, which was incredible. It went from doing something like 15 shows and ended up being 40. Um, so hopefully, if all goes well, we can get back on the road about March. That, that was... Uh, if it, beyond anything, an underlining of the fact that the whole concept of the Young Divas, the whole mixture of your talents together was always going to be hot, was always going to work. Um, did you realise back then when you first formed that this could be something as big as it ha has become? No, you, you it was never expected. It was know. a surprise yeah. for, for all of us, really. They're very humble. Have a listen to them. <laughs> no. Who's going to talk about how good we are, right? Eh? Now, come on. We want to know the goss too. Uh, teams don't necessarily love each other when they're together as long as you guys are. We know we work in a team. We have our moments here as well. Oh, we have moments. You have moments? Oh. Try, try it with right. females. Yeah. We have moments. Cat, you know, at that certain time. Well, you, mean, you mean row? Something well, like that? I mean, I don't know time? anybody who knows much about Not star round, signs, but, yeah. but we've got two Scorpios. 
and two Librans, which is pretty much yeah. two buff heads and two peacekeepers. So yeah. it, it's pretty interesting. <laughs> so it balances out. You'll be so, fine. You'll be fine. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming in. Good luck with um, the, the album, the single, the newest Thank release, you. which, of course, happening Thank all over you. again. And we look forward to seeing you on the road early next year. Hopefully. Yay! Thank, Thank you. Thank you.